Pro Stock Analysis Under 3 Minutes. We're going to be covering support, resistance levels, options, activity, and short interest on your favorite stocks. Let's get right to it. Support and resistance levels are very important because they let you know where supply and demand are meeting. On the right side, you'll see three support levels and also three resistance levels. These are areas that you want to watch when you're looking at this particular stock. Stocks typically bounce at support levels and they resist at resistance levels, meaning they'll retrace from that top level. You can see on the right side where the stochastic level is on this particular stock. This is only a technical update because you want to look for overbought and oversold conditions. With readings over 80% are considered overbought, and then readings below 20% are considered oversold. You want to be aware of this when you're looking at a particular stock. We've also provided today's volume of shares traded and also the average daily volume. You want to see how much volume is being traded and if it is above the average daily volume level or below. This tells you how relevant the move is from the stock today. We've provided details on today's option activity. What you'll be able to see here is options volume, open interest, implied volatility, put to call ratio, and IV percentile. One of the most popular indicators for traders is put to call ratio. When we're looking at put to call ratios, if we see anything above one, that is telling us that there is more bearish sentiment in the market rather than bullish. If we see something more of 0.5 or 0.7, that tells us that it's more bullish than bearish. This indicates there's more calls being purchased rather than puts. Hopefully you enjoyed this update. Please be sure to subscribe to the channel and like the video. Thanks a lot and look forward to more updates every single day.